Welcome to Tax Bites, our fortnightly free tax podcast on current issues facing tax practitioners. I'm Rob Clementi from the Education Network, and with me today is Brian Hall from Townsend Law. Brian recently presented a webinar on tax implications of trust vesting. Brian, thanks for joining us. Why is trust vesting such an important issue? Well, vesting of a family trust is, is very important uh, for, for three main reasons. Uh, first of all, the, the, the tax issues, there are uh, many tax implications around vesting. Um, and, and that's because vesting or, or, or ending of a trust uh, means that all the assets of the trust will be disposed of. And that's gonna be whether, whether that's voluntarily by design uh, or, or simply by default, because you didn't get around to, to, to designing your, your exit strategy. Uh, now, ideally, you, you really want to be able to plan for the vesting of the trust uh, several years in advance, um, particularly where there are uh, or is the potential for significant uh, capital gains tax uh, and stamp duty implications. So the idea is to, to want to be able to determine um, who gets what in terms of the, the taxable income and taxable capital gains of the trust uh, in terms of the beneficiaries uh, as tax effectively as possible. Um, now, of course, if you miss the vesting date, you miss that opportunity. Um, but not only that, if you continue to administer the trust um, as if it hadn't vested, then there can, there can be all sorts of uh, issues there, such as uh, distributing income and, and capital gains to the wrong beneficiaries, um, needing to redo tax returns and tax assessments, uh, payment of tax interests and penalties, uh, breach of trustee duties and all sorts of things. Um, now, the second main thing um, is asset protection. Uh, people often use family trust, discretionary family trust, for, for asset protection reasons. Um, now, once the trust vests, those assets need to come out of the trust again. Um, so the, the issue of asset protection for those assets becomes live all over again. Um, so if you can plan the vesting in advance, then you may, but may be able to direct uh, the assets of the trust to those beneficiaries who are, are least exposed to risks such as bankruptcy, uh, relationship breakdown and so forth. Um, and then the third main reason why trust vesting is, is very important uh, is simply for the succession and, and estate planning uh, implications. Now, depending on the assets of the trust and, and who gets what in terms of beneficial entitlements, the distribution of the assets from the trust may well give rise to important issues of estate equalization um, and, and how to manage the estate objectives of the head of the family in terms of their will and dealing with other structures. Thanks. Thanks, Brian. If you'd like to know more, please visit our website at tved.net.au and you can order a copy of the on-demand version of his webinar.